Now, let's hope. Let's just pray that I'm having a little luck with at least one out of three orders. Blu-ray case, one of them arrived in completely bad condition. One of the jewel cases of another infected mushroom album is cracked and I don't have a working replacement. And yeah, this, these are two more infected mushroom CDs, Army of Mushroom and Legend of the Black Shawarma. So let's have a look at those. I hope they came along better, especially with that little fragile thingy here. And I only make good experiences from with the seller so far. They pack it very well. This wasn't even wrapped in bubble wrap or something. So, yeah. Let's have a look then, shall we? Now, there's one thing the seller can do is challenge Fort Knox. Because getting into this is always a good challenge. Thanks for keeping my shit safe, man. I appreciate it. One of my favorite Discord sellers you are. Really like you. How do I get in? Well, it looks like I've destroyed the cardboard anyway, so I'll just cut around this corner and holy shit, man. Oh boy. And we can lift it open. And as you can see, there is a second layer of Fort Knox in here. This is already empty, so we can put it aside. I'm having my doubts that this is damaged in any way. So, yeah. We shall see. I can already see, in, see Army of Mushrooms shining through. Also rolled up in two different directions, which is always a plus. And the third layer. Holy shit, man. You my guy. <laughs> I'm loving it. What a way to package. And these are wrapped, indivi wrapped individually too. Holy smokes, man. All right. <laughs> now, let's have... Oh, they're both originally sealed as well. And if we have a look at Army of Mushrooms. Mm, nothing is cracked. Nice. Here is the front. Spine for you. And of course, the most important thing, the front. Let's open it up. I'm such a bloody idiot. Well, luckily this didn't end bloody. Oh, that plastic is thick. Oh boy. Oh. I can't even get in here. Here it is. Looking great. So let's have a look inside. Here is the disc. As you can see by the reflection, this has a weird touch. The logos have as well. Really nice, really nice. It has the CD logo up in the top left. Ah. There we go. We got the booklet out. Opening it up. Looking great. This is how I want my CDs to be. In good, nice condition. Thank you very much. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Let's try again to get this booklet in correctly. There we go. And let's have a look at under the disc. The screaming mushrooms. Okay, they use the same image twice there. The disc is looking very good. I have no complaints about this. I'm very happy. Now let's have a look 
at arguably one of the best infected mushrooms to date. Even comes with a slip cover. The legend of the black shawarma. Holy shit, this is looking lit. This is some premium shit right here, so I gotta be extra careful opening it. Yep, I will actually use a razor blade for this. Just because it's so much slimmer. Here we go. Holy smokes. It's a bit dented, but who cares, man? Oh, hell yeah. Here is the spine. Here is the front. Let's slide it out. And oh, sweet. Now that's how I want my things to be. Oh. There's some kind of goo there. Ooh. Okay. It's not on the back though. Maybe we can get rid of it from the inside. No, it's not goo, it's some kind of scratchings. But actually I've had that quite a lot with CDs from Israel. Now, that's how the CD is looking looking good and an extra thick booklet with this one. Oh my god oh oh boy okay okay it's lyrics obviously let's see if it has anything else okay well looking nice looking nice under the disc Discs itself is looking good under the disc as well. I'm very happy with this. Finally, some good news for the day, man. And with that being said, I thank you very, very much for watching. And I hope to see you all very, very soon in another upcoming video. In another video, perhaps. We'll see. For this time, thanks for watching and bye bye.